It's midnight and it's tea time. Imagine teeing off when the clock strikes midnight. It should be dark, but at this golf course, the sun hangs in the sky 24 hours a day. We are above the Arctic Circle at 69 degrees north, and at Lufoten Golf Links between May and August, you can play round the clock. That's, that's more than uh, 16 years ago. It was a friend of my father who uh, went to uh, Scotland and saw the golf courses in Scotland and the landscape looks a bit the same. So he came uh, home from Scotland and the on a midnight evening like this, he, uh, he came home to our family and asked whether we shouldn't try to make a golf course here. Things didn't really happen before uh, eight years ago when, when I took up the project. So it's a, it's a true links course. It's, uh, you can't get any closer to the sea. It's not possible. You, you play over the sea and at the wintertime, three of the greens are covered by sea. And we have to remove the seaweed from the bunkers every spring. The course is uh, yeah, it's nine holes. We have white yellow and, and red tees. It's a, quite, it's a quite short course. It could look short, because, uh, but it's, when it's windy, it's, and usually it's of some kind of wind here. So it always, it's, it's longer. As, a, as all the links courses, it's, it's longer because of the wind. Tees are very spectacular from cliffs and from you play over beaches. And you, but you have to be here and you have to play it to, to really understand it. Many people hear about this midnight tea time and midnight to play at night, but you really have to do it to understand it, you know, to see the colors and... To, to experience it. Lufoten Golf Links offers accommodation and restaurant facilities on site. Alternatively, you can stay at the Henningsvad Brygge Hotel, a delightful harborside hotel with a cozy atmosphere and a manager who doubles as a hotel chef. The Lufotens are a nature lover's paradise. There is so much to do. Uh, what we can offer is uh, fishing, and we do kayaking, canoeing, both uh, at sea and in the lakes around in the area. And we do hiking, hiking in the mountains, both summer and winter. Overnight trips in tents or lavos all year through. And skiing in the wintertime is really nice in this area. Going to get one. Big one. Fishing is a spectacular experience. You're almost guaranteed to get a bite. I got one, I got one. <laughs> For me it's pretty big, but it's it's a small one. Got another one. Three. Two small.